Hi there, it's Wes again, and thank you so much for your interest in uh, yesterday's webinar. I just wanted to uh, put some context around this document that I'm sending to you as part of it. Um, it's really about how to make your period of tenure a success. It's very aligned to what we were talking about yesterday, but uh, suffice to say, I just wanted to recap a lot and just unpack a few issues. So if you want success during your tenure, Obviously, uh, strategic goal achievement is that definition of success. If those goals have been clearly defined, and of course they would be in your strategic plan, but what we've always maintained and we started to talk about yesterday is that governance strategy is your best bet. You've got to align governance strategy to your strategic plan in order to achieve your strategic goals. So when we talk about governance strategy, what it requires is a governance plan. It's the ability to execute governance strategy against your strategic plan. But it's also important to have governance capacity building. And we talk about, you know, governance tools that you may need, just like what we have at Govern With, and obviously governance resources, which was very much uh, in line with yesterday's session that we had. But importantly, you need that capacity building to implement your governance plan. And What's really, really exciting about what we've done at Govern With and our flagship product, Boardroom Plus, is that we can instantly generate a 12-month governance and capability development plan tailored to your unique governance circumstances. So now this, uh, it's a lot easier and speedier to be able to implement and execute straight away. Now, when we're considering a uh, governance strategy and a governance plan uh, included in Boardroom Plus, is that there are potentially 71 governance risks to your plan. So your instant governance plan considers and identifies and addresses the risks that are unique to your organization and circumstances. And then they're integrated into a 12 month capability development plan, uh, program. But also managing those 71 governance risks, cyber, as we spoke about for the last three months, cyber is just one of the 70, 71 risks that could risk you achieving your strategic goals to successfully achieving your strategic goals. So there's a lot there to consider. Now at Govern With, we develop high functioning boards, directors and executives. Um, just to make that clear, that that's what we do um, day in, day out. Now our flagship product, as I mentioned, was is uh, Boardroom Plus. Uh, it, uh, it handles the independent reviews for the board and for director's uh, skills matrix. It's very, very targeted in the development, and we'll talk about that in a sec. But what's really, really new to the market is board succession management. It's really, really cool and uh, is very, very helpful for creating that stability between periods in your governance cycle, in your three-year strategic plan. And best of all, for our community, we have sector-specific or industry-specific governance questions and content for the healthcare, aged care, human services, education and community. So it's in line with all the legislative and compliant um, needs for those industries. So it's very, very tailored to those industries. Now, this is just what Boardroom Plus does, just so you know. Um, it asks the right questions. It's the highest quality questions because Boardroom Plus is the only provider that ask questions across corporate or professional, across the contemporary sectors, such as cyber, such as modern slavery, ESG, the full gamut of contemporary issues, as well as the industry specific questions, which we just spoke about then in the previous slide. And really there's only two assessments before you unlock the value of the platform. So obviously there's a, an assessment for board governance and uh, also director skills matrix. But once the last director of the board has finished the assessment, it unlocks, instant, instantly unlocks all these insights. They're instantly available group results, uh, but also for the individual directors, there's interactive dashboards for the group and the individuals. It instantly creates actionable recommendations. So this is where we talk about actually um, creating a bespoke plan unique to your circumstances. That's instantly available. <clears throat> it identifies the top risks to your circumstances, your situation, which is really, really cool. And obviously uh, then outlines development opportunities for your team. 
Um, and of course, we do provide video results, uh, feedback overview on top of that. But what's really, really important is the bespoke uh, development plans because they're customizable, they're downloadable, and they're suitable for the board papers as well. But it's once again unique to uh, your circumstances. So when you're an incredibly time poor uh, board member, you're probably working a day job, knowing that any effort that you do for capability development, capacity building is highly, highly targeted. So you're getting high bang for your buck in terms of your effort and your energy as a director. And of course, board, Boardroom Plus is part of Govern With. It's, it's got an incredible success and customer success system that supports it over that 12 month journey. So you're hitting your goals. Uh, that What that means is it's got easy implementation. And of course it adapts to as your team and your directors develop too, so it can grow uh, as you get better and, and more functioning. But what's really, really unique about Boardroom Plus and its capabilities is this board succession tool. It's, it's fantastic, it's easy to learn and use. And so that way, once you see those gaps, out of the data, you can choose to develop directors to fill some of those gaps or opportunities to develop, or you can recruit for it or both. And so you can use this tool for director recruitment, for transition management, for helping people out, but also for induction planning. Really, really good to uh, use those strengths as well of the incoming uh, directors as well and, and create a bespoke induction plan. Uh, all the data is benchmarked against uh, sector peers, uh, which is great. And our cycle normally cuts off or does cut off in June 30 each year. What's really unique about the platform is it's focused on disproportionate impacts such as cyber. You know, we can instantly identify the the risks uh, that are present to your strategic plan, but we can also identify which ones are going to have a higher impact than others that really, really need to be addressed. And, and cyber is a classic example of that because that has disproportionate impact. Um, so we can, you know, that would be in the greater risk category, but obviously it also identifies the board strengths as well and how that can be implemented as well. We have a, a, a ever growing library of development resources, um, which once again makes development time and capacity building really, really time efficient because you're only working on what you need to do and we can link them to the action plans as we're building them out so you don't have to go off buying courses, etc. You're getting very, very tailored resources to your development plans that need need to happen. And, and Boardroom Plus is the only development program that combines corporate, contemporary and industry specific governance content. So those questions is the best practice out there in Australia right now. There's no one doing it. And we're so confident of this product that if you apply it and, and get the most out of it, uh, that you will become a high functioning board. And that that's what we guarantee that we provide all the tools and the systems and the advice and the software to make that happen. So if you're very, very serious about it, um, certainly book a demonstration if you want to see it as a board. Uh, commonly, a really, really good way to see what's possible with Boardroom Plus is to set aside 45 minutes before your next board meeting. And um, I'm happy to jump on and just show you what it can do. But Alternatively, you can have a discovery call or a governance strategy session, which we spoke uh, about yesterday, um, to also really just tight, you know, tighten up that governance roadmap and align governance strategy. But what we're, I'm telling you here today is that Boardroom Plus can instantly develop that governance strategy and that governance plan for you uh, and that plan of action. So who's it for? It's for the chairperson who wants to have a high functioning board. It's as simple as that. That's what our goal, this transformational goal. And so you can achieve your strategic goals and enjoy a successful tenure period.